Okay, here's a quick video tutorial on how to use Ubermenu with Thesis 2.0. Now, unfortunately, Thesis 2.0 does not use theme locations when it calls WP Nav Menu. You can see here it says your theme supports zero menus. So that means it doesn't meet the Ubermenu requirements because Ubermenu has to attach to a specific theme location in order to activate that menu. Um, but Thesis has this capability called boxes, and you can create a custom box to easily integrate Ubermenu. So uh, the first thing we need is the uh, box module. And I just want to say a quick thanks to Tim Milligan for originally uh, coming up with the solution. I just modified it uh, specifically uh, for Ubermenu. And you can download it uh, from my support site. There will be a link in the support guide. So once we've got the actual uh, Ubermenu thesis.box zip, we can go to Thesis, Boxes, we click Upload Box. Now we can just drag the file that we just downloaded uh, into the file chooser, or you can open it up and select that. Click Add Box, you'll see it'll install it. Close that window. Now we need to check Ubermenu Thesis Box and click Save Boxes. At this point, we can head over to the Thesis Skin Editor, and we'll now have a new box type called Ubermenu Nav Menu. So we can give it a name, add the box, then shift drag it into the template. Now you can see we have both an Uber menu and a regular nav menu, so I'm just going to leave it like that for the time being. Uh, so let's just first take a quick look at, at what the site currently looks like. This is just the, the default thesis layout. Um, you can see the default menu here, and we're going to replace this with Uber menu. So if we go back to the skin editor, we can now save this template. Um, what we want to do is go to our dashboard and then go to Appearance, Menus. And now that we've installed this box, you'll see that we have a, uh, a theme location. So we check off Uber Menu Thesis and set our menu. Save both those things. Uh, then we come over to Sandbox, uh, to our uh, home page of the sandbox and refresh and now you'll see that here's our uber menu so now the only thing we have left to do is actually remove the original nav menu um, so we can just drag it to remove it from the from the page or you can uh, delete the box completely uh, it's up to you uh, now we save our template go back to the front end and you'll see we have uh, just the uber menu left and of course you can uh, drag this around wherever you like within your template. And uh, that's how we can integrate Uber Menu with Thesis 2.0. Hope that's helpful.